Hey y'all, how's everybody doing? Well, I am getting ready and I thought, why not get ready together? My little curls are stuck in my cool drizzy earrings. I want to say drizzy, yeah. that is French. No, it's not. It's Russian. It's my friend. Drizzy. <laughs> okay, so see? Aren't these pretty? You guys, these are from Noonday. I know some of you are like, I'm not from about Noonday already, but they really are cool. How y'all doing? My coffee's cold. Okay, one of the things I'm going to do while I get ready, um, put on my Amaravitsa. Amaravitsa. And I believe she is, was the Queen of Hungary. And, yeah, Queen of Hungary mist. And this was a mist that she would use that supposedly made her so beautiful. She could get a man 50 years younger than her or something like that. I don't know. Y'all know I never know my stuff. But I do try to keep it below my eyes, which kind of means you don't get it right there. But I guess you could. But anyway. Oh, I know you're not supposed to smell it either right into your lungs. But that smells so good. You know what it reminds me of? It must be heavy, heavy, heavy orange blossom. But anyway, it's just a good moisturizing mist and then you can press it into your head just laying down some moisture remember the old uh, aftershave commercials where they go that really hurt <laughs> well while I'm letting that dry a second let me show you a little haul thing I got this is from Bath and Body Works and one of their brands is White Barn and I just loved the white marbleization. I sound drunk. <laughs> the white marbleization. To prove I'm not drunk. Um, and this is called Marshmallow Musk. And it's got a little marble top and everything. And it it does. It, it, last night I was thinking, you know, this just smells like marshmallow. But now I get the musk undertone. I really like this candle. I should be lighting this candle. Let's do this one. Y'all, do you know what? On this candle, let me show y'all. This is so pretty. Look how it looks like patinaed copper. But I pulled the little wick. You know how it, when it burns, it gets like the little ball on top. I pulled that off, and I pulled the, almost the whole wick off. So I guess I better let that uh, redo itself. But anyway, then this one's gonna go up there. I love it. Marshmallow musk, white burn. What else did I get? I got these little clean slate finger makeup wipes. All right, so you know how you take a wash rag and you ruin a whole wash rag with a stain? I do. I need to wash these first. But instead, there's um, five of them. There's, so there's one for every day of the week that you are putting on makeup. People assume you don't on the weekends. That is such a wrong assumption. Meanwhile, anyway, you put it on your finger, wet it, put your um, uh, like remover lotion on it, and just remove. And then toss it in the wash for the week. I just think that's cute. And look at them all. I've got, I had a little light pink one I used today. What it is, is, you know, I take my makeup off at night, but for some reason in the morning, it's back. I didn't get all my mascara off last night. I'll just be honest with you, because it's waterproof, and I just wasn't into it. I was just like, I'm, I gotta go to bed. I can't get it all off. But look, I've got teal, purple, pink. It's that real soft kind of microfiber. And, um, cheetah. And so, here's the one thing. My only concern is going to be... The fibrousness of it. There's already fiber, but it hasn't been washed, so maybe that's it. I'll let you know if I would get those. So don't get them yet. Where'd I get those? Bath and Body Works, I think. Um, also, I went by Ulta, and guess what I got? The very last in existence chocolate bonbons. I'll tell you, because somebody had put it back in the wrong place. There was another one in the store, and I, and because I, I'd previously called and said, can you call around? No other stores had it. And she can't walk back over to me. She goes, ma'am, I'm sorry. They, they, because of the $24 sale, because it's normally $50, they cut it down to, or $49, they cut it down to um, $24. Because of that sale, um, it's not even available online anymore. I walked down the aisle and found one in the tart section. I was looking in tart, and I was like, uh, that would be my... It does smell like chocolate. It is new. Nothing I can tell has been tried. I think they misplaced this in the first place. That's the palette. It's one of my all-time favorites. I've learned to just pull back and let y'all see it from back here. 
Um, I just like the colors. Mine I don't like because these fall out. Let's see if they fall out. They don't. I think mine got hot. And I just dropped my glasses over there. Ooh. Sorry. I got to pick them up. And I just noticed that my little baby velvet... Just her little tail is sticking out from under the couch. It's like a settee over there. And she, just her tail sitting out. She's so stinking cute. Where am I going to put my glasses so they won't fall off again? Okay. Then the other thing I got, uh, we went to Books of Man and I got some devotionals and Bible stuff for my grandbaby and her best friend. And so we also got a little, two, three sets of these, I mean two sets of these that had three in each. So I got six. And I let them pick four and I kept two. And I kept the two that were on, um, well this top coat peels really bad. I just put it on last night, it's already peeled. Oh my gosh, y'all, this peeled so bad. Why would you want to put the top coat on that's going to peel? Not with Pacifica, y'all. I have to take this off before I do this. I'm so all over the place this morning. We'll talk about that in a minute. But anyway, this little, um, as it say, be joyful in hope. That's um, patient reflection. That's a, that's a piece of another verse. Romans 12, 12. And it's just an empty, you know, it's a place to take notes during church. Or if you're uh, studying a particular subject, sometimes you like to have a little mini notebook for just that subject that you're taking notes on. Um... But anyway, so I got the two on Hope, and they got other ones that were pretty and looked like matched what their new devotion and journals look like. So anyway, this color from Chanel is 566, and it's called Wash Denim, and it's like a blue-gray, and it cannot wait. I want to put it on and kind of move a little from summer into fall. It's just a little, just a little gray, not much. I like the grays. I think grays are pretty. I cannot get over how bad this top coat is, y'all. If I put this on top, it's just going to peel right off. I think. Okay. Let's get my face on, y'all. Seriously, this is frightening. Alright, so we're doing Chanel. What color? 22 page rose. Y'all should know that by now. <laughs> or whatever your color is. You don't have to know my color. <laughs> Um, and the thing is, people say, well, I look just like you, I think. It's, you got to be careful of lighting, because lighting's brightening me, but I am pretty pale. <laughs> but I like to add, I like the, um, that it's more beige, not so ivory. And y'all, I should not, there's a reason for the order of things. I should not have, um, done my hair before my makeup because now it's going to look just I'm trying to mash in when I get back there so it doesn't so much get my hair and come across here lightly down the nose either side and the inner the nose under the mouth right there kind of mash hard back there just because yeah I uh <laughs> Don't want it to all get my hair. I'm using, since this is a flathead kabuki, I'm using the edge of it to go around my nose. You see that? That's so you'll get this little crux right there. You don't have a little makeup pool in there. It looks gross when people do that. Okay, I'm just making sure I've got good coverage. So, a couple little flukes, and I'm going to go over my eyelid, almost like it's going to be my eyeshadow primer, just because it'll make it a little sticky. Not sticky, sticky. This isn't sticky makeup. I'm just going to kind of push it in on either side of my nose, especially because your pores get very large. Elongate and get rid of that makeup line. I saw a lady the other day. I didn't know her well enough. I wish I would have just ignored that fact and helped her. Because she had, a, or, first of all, her makeup was not matched well. It was too orangey for her skin. Very, very pale skin. And there was a clear line. I was like, oh. Do like that and get rid of that line and blend down. Blend down, honey. Looks terrible. Just terrible. Okay. Where's my makeup? Yeah, there it is, makeup. Towel. There we 
go. Let me go out and get some new black towels today. Oh, that'd be nice. <laughs> and then kind of give it a good turn it. And then kind of get it back in shape. Here. One bad thing about your makeup, uh, things that like that, everything flows down into the ferrule. And it, in my house, it's getting little fuzzes on it. I bet it does in anybody's house. Really, your makeup uh, brushes should hang like that. Actually, I believe there's a contraption at SigmaBeauty.com. I need to look for that. Instead of doing it in little cups, even though there's so many little pretty cups that I have. Remember that one from Christmas last year? That's it. This is from Mophie when I got that copper set. Y'all, do you realize I have four sets of brushes just on my desk, and this is not as many brushes as I have. I have one of those Pampered Chef um, kitchen tools carousel that swings around. It's full of them. It's ridiculous. I don't know why I think I need so many. I feel a fuzz. I feel a fuzz on my face, y'all. Right in my tear duct. I don't see it, but I feel it. Maybe it's one of my regular hairs. Sorry, just... Um, I'm sure it's not. Maybe it is. I'm so getting ready with y'all. This is so, like, personal. Oh, I'm at it. Let's, while I'm getting things out of my eye, let's put stuff back in, shall we? Where's my little, um... Hello? We'll just use It Cosmetics. Because we haven't given up on it completely. Oh, there was a little hair. We're going to scroll it up. This is the It No Tug Gel Waterproof Liner. And the good thing about it is it's so smooth as a gel, you don't even have to pull down the flap of your skin. And it takes pretty quickly. There it goes. 